After years of trial and error, I finally came up with a daily routine that gave me satisfaction and allowed me to be as productive as I wanted to be daily. I will share this routine in this video. Hi, if you are new here, consider subscribing so that you can be informed when I put out amazing videos like this one. So, without further ado, here is what my daily routine looks like. I wake up by 5.30 am every day. Between 5.30 a.m. and 6 a.m., I write down my dreams and also three words I want my life to be centered around. For you, these words could be anything. For example, patient, kind, and present. Or, focused, disciplined and determined. Anything at all that you feel will give you an identity that you love. Write it a few times and understand what those words mean while writing them down. By 6 a.m., I say my prayers, which I do in the form of chant and contemplation. I do this for 20 minutes. After that, I put on my sportswear and head for the gym. When I was starting out though, what I usually did was to run round my neighborhood. I did not spend more than 15 minutes per session, then I would return home and do some indoor exercises. In total, I spend about 30 minutes daily on exercises. Studies have shown that exercise is crucial for physical, mental and emotional well-being. And research by Brendan Burchard has shown that high performers are more likely to work out at least five times a week. This was the reason I added exercise to my daily routine. Check out my video on high performance. The link will be in the description box below. So, the time now is about 7 am and then I head to the bathroom. I use the toilet, take my bath, brush my teeth, have breakfast, and get set for my morning hours of productivity. For you, this could be your 9 to 5 job, it could be school, it could be your company, or maybe you are an online kinda guy and you just sit in front of your laptop and begin the grind. The idea is that you prepare to work for a couple of hours without distraction. Just before I begin my morning hours of productivity which, by my timetable, is from 8.30 am to 4 pm, I sit for a few minutes to meditate. I had to incorporate this into my routine because of the recent amazing findings about the benefits of meditation. And a lot of really successful people have meditation as an integral part of their daily routine. I have an audio record on my phone. And in that audio, I talked about my perfect life, the things I want to do with my life daily, and the values I want to build my life around. This audio is about 3 minutes long. I tried to keep it simple. During meditation, I listen to this audio. It reminds me of what my life should be about and it keeps me pumped and fired. Feel free to change the audio anytime you want if your goals have changed or you suddenly want something else out of life. After this, I begin working and I try to stay busy until about 4 pm. I try to take very short breaks in between, I drink a lot of water. And I rarely skip lunch. By 4 pm, I try to get some rest. I set an alarm to wake me up my 8 pm. When I wake, I take something light that would serve as the last meal for the day. Then I sit on my table once more for my night hours of productivity. By 8.30 pm, I am seated on my table. And the first thing I do is to go through my journal. I review the mistakes I have made so far in this life and I write new ones. The idea is not to regret them, the idea is to pick the lessons and keep track of whether you are implementing those lessons. A very light example would be that you realized that eating a certain food for breakfast negatively affects your morning productivity hours. You write it down and ensure you don't eat it for breakfast again. It could be habits that are bringing you down and how you want to change them, etc. After that, I spend an hour reading a book. The average CEO reads one book a week and that translates to 54 books a year. It is my dream to someday become a very big investor, therefore, reading books has to be incorporated into my daily routine. There are great books out there, and the more of them you read, the greater your chances of becoming very successful. After those, I say my prayers. Once again, by chance and contemplation. Then, I begin my night's work. I work until about 2.30 am. Then I go to bed and begin the routine again the next day. I must say that I do not usually achieve this much success every day, but 5 days out of 7 in a week, I consider as a win. This routine definitely cannot suit everyone and I don't think people who are married can do this because of commitments to family. 
but I think having a routine is very essential because it saves you from the stress of trying to plan your day every day and if you stick to a certain routine, eventually you realize that you can sustain a very healthy and productive daily routine on autopilot. For those working on a 9-to-5 job, you may decide to work during the day and at night, learn a skill, start an online business, start a company, etc. Four hours at night every day spent on a personal project becomes something remarkable after a couple of months. What most of us lack is consistency. And to succeed at anything, consistency is a must. For me, during the day, I build my career, and at night, I focus on building my skills, investing, learning, online businesses, taking care of my channel etc. It does not have to be this particular routine, but having a daily routine is essential, no doubt. Or you may decide to build a routine for the first 6 hours after you awake from sleep and the last 6 hours before you go to bed. The idea is to do what is suitable for you based on your present circumstances. So, a quick summary goes thus, wake up early, journal, say your prayers, then do morning exercise. Take your bath, prepare for the day. Meditation. Start your morning productivity hours, stay focused, drink a lot of water, take short breaks here and there and don't skip lunch. Take a few hours of rest in the evening, eat a light meal for dinner, review your journal, read a book and say your prayers. Begin your night productivity hours, stay focused and remember to get some rest before morning. If you enjoyed this video, remember to like, share and subscribe. I will see you in the next video. Thanks for watching. And as always, stay energized.